Who are you and where are you from? Hi, my name is Efrosini Pizzalidou, best known as Frosi, and I'm a pencil artist from Greece. Tell us a bit about your practice. What do you do? I use pencils to create thought-provoking, heartwarming and eye-pleasing art. I love experimenting with different media and adding petit elements such as sea cells, beads and the like on my artworks. And I've recently started exploring the digital world of Procreate, but I still consider myself a pencil artist for the most part. How do you do it? I will use my Spring Lady, a piece I'm currently working on, to display my technique. Everything starts with a few messy lines. Once the rough sketch is finished, I use my watercolor pencils to set the base colors and then a handy brush <laughs> to spread the colors. After that, it's time for the classic color pencil to take over. So I add layers and values. And next step is black. I use plain pencils for light shading, but when real black is needed, 5B is my one and only option. Often enough, I use a tortillon. I think it's pronounced like that, but this is the tool I'm referring to. It's perfect for the smudge effect and it saves me so much time. Last but not least, my favorite part. I add tiny highlights and uh, details with a white ballpoint pen. <laughs> when did you start? According to my mother, more than three decades ago, my three-year-old self used to proudly declare, when I grow up, I'll be a painter. I have been exploring the infinite potential of art media ever since. Who or what inspires your practice? I do have a soft spot for mythology. I love reshaping ancient myths, but in my case, it's mostly about thoughts that wish to be transformed into pictures, and then pictures that wish to enhance the inner smile of the viewers. Even if it is a bittersweet smile, a smile is always the goal. What are you exhibiting at Clash 2022? The Lacuna Festival's Class 2022 have selected two drawings of mine for their virtual exhibition. You can see the first one right here. <laughs> it's Mars through the myth of Penthesilia. And the second one is named the River of Rue. How does it link to the theme of Clash? Both of my artworks emphasize moments of realization and enlightenment as a dramatic yet hopeful aftermath of never-ending collisions. It's more like a meta-class where you actually get to confront your conscience and really see everything that truly matters. Why did you apply for Clash 2022? I ran across the open call on Instagram and the caption really got me hooked. Open-ended questions, wide philosophical approach, amazing use of words to inspire art that goes beyond aesthetics. I could hardly ignore such an opportunity, so I headed over to the website uh, where I found out more about the Lacuna Festivals and the awesome duet behind it. Uh, even the application form was friendly, respectful and interesting. I wanted to be a part of this and I'm so glad I got chosen. Where can people find out more? If you are interested in my art and the background thoughts regarding the creation of each piece, you can find me on Instagram as MyFrowings or through my name, Frosipitsalidu. You can also check out my website dedicated to my 12th Olympian Identities collection, where you can discover the myth of Penthesilia related to this piece. <laughs> Any kind of support is highly appreciated. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my interview. Enjoy the Lacuna Festivals and all the precious moments in your life. Bye!